Hey guys, Tales of Creed here. Welcome to a new Let's Play. One that you guys helped pick. Tales of Vesperia. Whew, I didn't think I'd be starting a new uh, Tales game so soon, but it's all on you guys. And honestly, I'm pretty excited to get this going. So uh, let's start this up. If I don't get moving soon, uh, it's going to go back to uh, the title screen. Well, the intro. Now I don't want to get stuck there. So, um, I've only beaten this game once. So I'm going to be sharing my second playthrough with you guys. I was playing this on my own, but I didn't really get that far into it on my second run. Um, so I was thinking of doing, like, adding some new stuff, but you might as well just go new game on Let's Play. So let's do this! Our world... Terka Lumeres. No one knows how far its lands and oceans stretch. For the people are no match against the hordes of monsters that crawl the earth. Barriers protect the cities in which we live, and we are completely dependent upon them for our survival. These barriers are generated by the Blastia, Blastia use the primeval power of air that fills the world to provide us with fire, water, and light. They provide us with everything that has made the Empire prosper. Forget the threat of the vicious monsters lying in wait, just beyond the barriers. The blessings of the Blastia will bestow ever more prosperity to the world and peace to its people. I don't get it. What could have happened to the barrier in this town? From the Imperial capital, Zophius, bedrock of peace, we pray, may tranquility bless this world. What's with all the yelling, Ted? Look! The Aqua Blasty is broken again! And they just finished fixing it! What's the big deal? Just leave it to the mighty Imperial Knights. That's what they're there for. Huh, the Knights? You know they never come to the lower quarter. What about the heroic Flynn? I already tried to get Flynn. They wouldn't even let me see him! Huh. So I'm Flynn's replacement, huh? Never mind that. Come on! We're short on people! Ted! Ted! You get down here! They need your help, too! I'll... I'll be there in a sec! Yuri, come on already! That's weird. He always comes running whenever there's trouble. 
This place is gonna become an aquarium soon if this keeps up. Sounds like we got a pretty big problem on our hands. I mean, you'd think at least one person be guarding that. I mean, their whole lower quarter is about to be flooded. I'm gonna go back to my room, though. I don't want to see if there's anything in here. I actually don't remember if there's anything in here, but... I don't need to rest. Got an apple gel. But every day in the lower quarter. First, the trouble with the knights yesterday. Now the aqua blast here breaks. Why does stuff like this happen every day in the lower quarter? I know, I know. There's no use whining about it. If you didn't know, um, Yuri has a little pal. Um, his name is Rapide. He's just a dog, but he's pretty much the most badass dog in any game ever. He's pretty fucking cool. And, uh, I think I'll save on saving for now. See what I said there. What up, bro? The Aqua Blast here broke, huh? No surprise there. They only let us have old beat up last year here in the lower quarter. Pfft. Sounds like the high class to me. But let's go check this out. We got to see it off somehow. What's going on? Any sunken treasure down there? Yeah, but you're late, so I'm not sure. <laughs> How nice. Hey, it's sink or swim in this world. Looks like that blue-blooded mage we hired to fix the blast deal left the job half done. Glad you can find the time to step by, Yuri! Take it easy with the water sports, old man. You're not getting any younger. You're up next! Not afraid of a little water, I hope! Yikes. Come on now, put your backs into it! Hey! Whoa! Things is really going at it. He feels responsible. He's the one who pushed the people to get the money together for the repairs. And now he's the one who's all wet. It's not Hanks' fault that mage did a two-bed repair job, though. That's true. He even parted with his wife's keepsake to help raise the money. in the center. Huh? Is it gone? Yeah, the Blastia won't work with the core missing. That aristocrat who came to do the repairs was the last person to touch the Blastia, right? That's right, a Mr. Mordial. And he lives in the Royal Quarter? Yeah, so? Forget about that, Yuri. Give us a hand here. Sorry, Hanks. I just remembered an errand I've got to run. Hey, wait just a minute! You're not seriously thinking of going to Mr. Morio's place, are you? The Royal Quarter? Me? I wouldn't be caught dead going to a place like that. It gives me the creeps. Damn it, Yuri! Just because you can do a few tricks with that bony blast here, you think you're invincible. Here's hoping he doesn't do anything crazy. He always seems to cause problems when the lower quarters involved. Even the knights are starting to keep an eye on Well, it's just an average day for Yuri. I'm sure he'll be fine. I'm fine, no worries. Friggin' Yuri is like... I could help, a little bit, but I'm just gonna go to a higher, like, place and fuck things up a little bit. But it looks like the, uh, core is missing. So that's what's causing this whole thing going on. 
And we gotta fucking find out what... Who did this shit. Might as well go over to the root of the problem, right? That's kind of like what Yuri's thing is. He always likes going to the root of the problem, whether it be like... Easy or difficult. Doesn't really matter to him. So, he doesn't mind doing all the dirty work. So, let's go check out, if we see uh, if we can meet with Mr. Mordio. Um... I hope you guys don't mind if I don't talk over the talking scenes. I'm not really sure if I will or not, since they're just like press buttons so I can like stop and talk whenever I want, but I figured I'd let them talk and let the story play out a little bit before I talk. So let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Welcome, if it isn't Yuri. We've got some good stuff on to sale today. So we could buy some stuff here. I don't really have a lot of money, so I can't really afford anything, but... Well, you can also, like, buy weapons, also, but... And stuff like that. But yeah, I have no money. So there's really no point to buy anything. We're just gonna head up to the, uh, upper quarter place. You there! You there! Are you aware of the serious events going on in the world? Over here! Right here! I'm the Wonder Reporter! What a great name. Bringing you the articles about what matters most every day. Do you read the newspaper in the morning? Cup of coffee? Donut? What? You don't? That just won't do. What epic thing has transpired today? You'll never believe it. Man, this Wonder Reporter knows like what to say. You can read it whenever, wherever, with no effort at all. Yes, it's the Wonder Log. Put it to good use. Hooray. And by the way, let's let the fact that I'm in the wall be, <laughs> be our little secret, okay? Yeah, no problem. Well then, farewell! And he just fades out on the wall. So it's, it's like a link between worlds. He just fucking he just went in there. But uh, we can access the Wonder Log whenever in the synopsis. I don't even remember what the Wonder Log is, so let's check it out. But um, this is the menu. You see Yuri here. I mean, it's, you know, it's a Tales game. I'm pretty sure everyone who voted for this game knows what a Tales game is, knows how it, know how it plays out. So you can check out, like, titles, and, you know, it's your regular Tales game. I'm personally not the greatest at this game, so I'm gonna have to get used to this game a little bit. But, um... What do we want to see? The synopsis? Synopsis? Oh, I guess the Wonder Log is pretty much the synopsis. Yeah. So we can check uh, our synopsis to pretty much like relearn things, you know, just in case you come back from the game after a while, you need to find out what to do. Just hit up the synopsis, you know, figure out what to do. So let's keep going. We're going to go catch Mr. Mortio, that little bastard. Hey, you hear about the blasty in the lower quarter? Shh, don't tell anyone. They're whispering. Yeah, I heard something about breaking and them collecting money to fix it. That's right. I hear that a lot went so far as to tell or to sell their treasures and save up the money. Treasures, sir? Worthless junk, nothing more. They wouldn't have gotten more than one gold for them. That's not very nice. I mean, they worked their asses off to get that money. Not even one gold. I can't imagine what sort of treasure those would or those would have to be. I'd like to have a look myself. I'm telling you. Nothing but junk. <laughs> Listen to those guys. Poor Hanks. Can't really argue with them about the junk thing, though. Whew. Ah! <laughs> what the? Who's there? So, one rock takes out these guys in helmets, by the way. It's pretty great. And this is what I mean by dirty work and Yuri. Yuri does not give two fucks about the law here. He doesn't mind throwing rocks at soldiers and knocking them out in one hit. It's pretty great. If you can't understand the value of junk, you're, wor you're worthless than junk yourself. Yeah, worth less than junk. He split it apart. It was like two words. Crazy. Repeat. Can you find the trail? Most of the beginning of the game is going to be dialogue and text boxes, so you're just going to have to get used to that as the story plays out for a little bit. But, this game gets going pretty fast. Um, it gets, like, 
maybe a little too fast in my opinion, but it, it gets going where you're going to get moving to different places really quickly. So, so they've been taking Blastia cores from here too. Looks like somebody's got some sticky fingers. That's the royal quarter for you. A few Blastia cores go missing and no one even makes a fuss. When just one is enough to throw the lower quarter into chaos. If they got cores to spare, they could stand to give us some. Too bad Troy Baker's not taking over. Found it. So if you didn't know, um, Yuri is voiced by Troy Baker, who is a fantastic voice actor. And we got a bunch of royal royalty hanging around. They don't give two fucks about us, but, you know. Anyway, nobles. Looks like the nobles are living the sweet life as usual. The lower quarter's right there. They still don't give a damn. It's not their loss, so what do they care? They should act, you know, noble. Not just dress nice and hide in their mansions. That's just kind of how they are. I mean, if you got money, you just pay our people to do the dirty work. But, looks like Rapid found out, like, the place where Mr. Mordio is, so let's check this, check this place out. So this is where he lives. Good job, Rapide. Sitting down all cool like. What a good dog. Doesn't seem like there's anyone around. Yeah, I'm sure kicking the door is gonna work. I wonder if there's any other way in. As this as the camera pans over to a window on the side. <laughs> I love that. It's like very nonchalant, but the camera does pan slowly over to this fucking window. <laughs> What's well, this one? Oh, is it open? Can I get in this way? I know Mordio is hiding here somewhere. Man, it's very quiet in here. It's kind of creepy. But I think if we, yeah. If we check these, we can get 100 gold. And anything over here. Magical ends. Very nice. Let's try going upstairs. Going up the stairs. Going down the stairs. Going up the stairs this time. Anyone home? Mr. Mordio. Kind of want to fuck you up. Won't open. What to do? That must be. Found him. Looks like we got you, buddy. You are Mordio, right? Oh, that was a quick escape. <laughs> Good boy. What the? The Blastia core is gone. Let's go and get that core back. And give that mage a whooping while we're at it. Woof! <laughs> yes, I get to do a dog voice! But yeah, he made off with it. Um, but yeah, just in case you're wondering, this game does move a bit quickly without explaining too much about characters. So, you're gonna have to wait a little bit before we learn a little bit more about Yuri. Yuri! So it is you who are the cause of all this commotion! Oh great! It's my favorite characters in the game! I mean, look at him! How could you not like that? I know he's poor, but breaking into an aristocrat's house? My, my, how the mighty have fallen! Just what I needed. Tweedle A and Tweedle B. Just I what say, is a Tweedle anyway? Me. There's no hope of escape! We've got you surrounded! Uh, 
Does it look like I'm trying to escape? See, it's stuff like that that keeps you guys from getting promoted. You did not just say that! I say, you take that back! I say! Enough beating around the bush, I guess. Alright, guys. Man. Always gotta get in the way. Stand back, Otacore! I'll handle this! In the name of the Imperial Knights! I say, I shall be the one to defend the good name of the Imperial Knights! Yes, I say! Peons, I say, should stand back! I, I just love that guy. Just the way he says this shit. Oh, he runs like a fucking moron, by the way. No, no, I say. I am your superior. You gotta check out how this guy runs. It's fucking great. It's like I appreciate retarded. the cinema, guys, but let's cut the cat fight and get on with it. All right, all right. So we got a tutorial fight. Uh, we can move forward and back, and then we can jump with... Uh, what's X on here? Oh, it's that. <laughs> I haven't played my Xbox in a really long time, so I need to get used to this shit. Target the nearest enemy with the right bumper. Change your target with the left stick. Oh, right bumper. I was holding the right trigger. Moving towards target enemy using the left stick. Blah, blah, blah. So we can just do that. Um, something I really like to do is free run. So we're going to free run a lot throughout the game, and I'm going to kick people's ass that way. Hey, let's go. You ready? I am your superior! Nay, focus. You are, I say, clearly my subordinate. I guess I just gotta whack these guys a little. Seems like it, Yuri. So we can perform a regular attack with B. Oh, I gotta get used to that. Can also perform attacks with B while moving the left stick and all that other stuff. Target will automatically switch to the enemy you hit while moving with the le left trigger. Left stick. Yay. Oh. Let's just start this up so I can actually practice. There, how'd that make you feel? I didn't even I didn't hit I didn't even hit anyone. I probably should have hit someone during that tutorial. Hitting someone in the middle of an argument is hardly proper manners. I didn't even hit you though. You can't even say that shit. Didn't you hear me when I said you ready? Or were you not listening? Damn it! Oh, oh brother. Can't believe these guys are like spreading rumors, you know? I bet these guys go around the fucking castle being like, Oh, you hear that? You hear about that Yuri guy? Fucking slam me across the face with his sword. It's ridiculous. It like I'm you, be quiet. Oops, time for a little defense. So we can use X to guard. <laughs> I'll guard sometimes, but I like the free run. My I did block your attack. That's pretty suggestive. It's suggestive. <laughs> Ooh, I say, how dare you block my art? Man, you need to calm down. If you can use strike arts here, then I can too. That's weird. Okay, I need to switch that up. I feel like A should be the attack. And oh. let's try that again. I might have to switch up the controls on that one because that's a little weird that the arts are A. So, let's go ahead and attack. So you can do regular attacks and then combo with the arts. It's pretty easy. I mean, if you played the Tales game, you pretty much know what to do here. And they're on their butts. I say, Imperial Knights never give up. You have yet to see our true power. This next time's for real, guys. That's my line, I say. That's my line. All right, the real fight starts. Look at this guy run. He looks like a fucking dumb. I'm already doing bad. I'm really not used to this whole like B A being arts and B being attack. Damn it! Ah, I'm doing so bad. There we go. Run! Already doing bad. But it's okay. I I'm trying to, like, separate them a little bit now. So, come over here, buddy. And that's already not working. Damn it. 
he just like roll on the ground to attack me? That was great. I just can't get over this guy like running. It's pretty great. Oh, there's one down. I say! <laughs> His form of speech is like pretty great. But once you get rid of one, the other is a joke. Because you can just run around him and done. You should thank me. I'm giving you some extra practice.